No fewer than 7,584 delegates from the 36 states of the Federation and the FCT attended the Convention of the Ruling Party All Progressives Congress in the Federal Capital Territory, Abuja. Admits candidates expressing interest for the seat of the chairmanship, six persons vying for the position stepped down from the contest. The six former candidates had to back the candidate of the president, Mahmoud Buhari, as their consensus candidate, Senator Abdullah Yadamu. This didn't stop different groups who came out en masse to support their candidates. As a coalition of civil society groups called out the governor of Central Bank of Nigeria, Godwin Omefile, to run as the presidential aspirant for the All Progressives Congress. <laughs> The group trade convener Basi Etuk described Emefile as a man of noble and impeccable character, worthy to run the affairs of the country, especially at a time the nation is grappling with economic meltdown. Etuk made this appeal to the Sibian governor while addressing journalists at a peaceful rally during the APC 2022 National Convention in Abuja. We have come to tell the world that if you want to pressure, MFLA is the answer. We have also come today to tell the world that if insecurity is to end, MFLA is the answer. We have come to tell the world and all the LPC leaders today don't know for facts. For us to grow in this country, economic wise, yeah. development wise, yeah. they should allow MFL yeah. to be the president of Nigeria come 2023. Yeah. We are now calling on MFL to come out and contest for the office of the president. Everybody, all Nigerians are calling on MFL to come out. Yes. I contest yes. for the office of the president. Yes. He deserves it. Yes. He's a man of peace. Yes. It is hoped that this call will bring forth the best candidate for the nation come 2023 as the convention is expected to approve the amended sections of the party's constitution and ratify the activities of the caretaker extraordinary convention planning committee.